she has been embracing her newly single status following her drawn out split from ex boyfriend Stephen Bay. And proving she is well and truly moving on from her reality star beau, Charlotte Crosby was seen passionately kissing her fellow MTV star Joshua Ritchie, as she celebrated her former Geordie Shaw co star Aaron Chalmers MMA win. Stepping out on Friday night for the fight in Newcastle, the reality beauty ended her evening by locking lips with Josh in a vert display, not caring who could see her as they smooched in front of fellow bargoers. Wrapping her arms around his neck, Charlotte seemed to throw herself into the steamy clinch and couldn't keep her hands off of the Love Island star. Josh, meanwhile, seemed more than happy to be on the receiving end of her affections, as Charlotte spoke into his ear and held on tightly to his neck. Kissing for everyone to see, the duo only had eyes for each other on the night off they appeared to hit it off while taking to their seats in the Metro Radio Arena to cheer on Aaron, as he embarked on his third MMA fight since turning his attentions to the sport. Josh had starred alongside Aaron on the sixth series of X on the Beach, where viewers saw him vying for the affections of his former Flame and Towie star Nicole Bass, who had also been in attendance on Friday night. The pictures will no doubt make for awkward viewing for Charlotte's ex-boyfriend Stephen Bay, as the reality stars will no doubt have crossed cuts, thanks to being on the same showbiz circuit. Charlotte was seen sitting on Yoshi's lap inside the arena, before being followed out by her latest love interest as he placed his hands on her shoulders as they exited the venue together. The former Geordie Shaw star had confirmed her status as a strong and single woman last month, following her breakup. She and Bay had been plagued by splits in the last few weeks of their 11-month romance, with the duo seeming to split and reunite on several occasions. However, according to The Sun, Bear insisted their relationship is over for good, as he claimed he is free and single and wants his next girlfriend to be someone who is not in the public eye. He said, we are just friends, I'm single, she's single, we're just mates and I think that's the best way for now. I'm just not ready to date at the moment, to sit next to anyone and start talking to them, or start bringing people up and asking to do something. The next girlfriend I have, I'd like to be someone that no one knows. The couple hit a crisis after the former scaffold worker was pictured heading home from a Halloween party with a mystery brunette in tow, amid claims of a reconciliation with Charlotte. Charlotte's roller coaster romance with Stephen seemingly came to a screeching halt in October and it appeared to be acrimonious at first, with the couple being plagued by cheating claims and Charlotte feuding with Bear's family on Twitter. They were then seen kissing and reportedly spent the night together following the MTV Emmas held in November, but their reunion allegedly got off to a bumpy start with the duo becoming embroiled in screaming matches before getting close again. An onlooker told the son, Charlotte and Bay were all over the place. Dot, one second they were kissing, cuddling and laughing, and the next they were having screaming matches.
romance first blossom for the pair early last year while presenting their joint MTV series Just the Two of Us. Following weeks of speculation about their relationship, Charlotte and Bear confirmed they were an item in a joint interview with OK! Magazine, with Charlotte claiming she had found the one in her former co-star Vicky Patterson's ex-boyfriend. Since their split, it has been confirmed that Bear has left just the two of us and will no longer present the show alongside Charlotte, with Scotty T stepping in to replace the star for its third series. Charlotte's major PDA with Josh, meanwhile, came as she joined a slew of reality stars at Heron's fight in her adopted hometown. She rocked a very revealing mint green dress that flaunted her incredibly Jim Hunt physique, thanks to its skin-tight design. She added height to her ensemble with a pair of pastel-hued sock boots, leaving her bronzed pins firmly on display. Charlotte accessorized her look with a simple nude clutch and kept her amazing pout on full display. The starlet kept her makeup simple yet dramatic, rocking statement brows with a dramatic smoky eye and highlighted swept cheeks. She wore her long glossy dresses down in tousle waves that fell past her shoulders while parted in the middle and appeared in high spirits as she turned out to support her palero. Charlotte had starred alongside Aaron on Geordie Shore before quitting the show before the summer of 2016, following a bitter breakup from on slash Shotbow and Aaron's BFF Gary Beadle. Charlotte was joined by her close pals Chloe Ferry and Sophie Cassiai, with both reality stars putting on a daring display. Chloe, who was dating former Love Island star Sam Gowlin following his addition to the Geordie Shaw cast, showed off her incredible frame in a dress that left little to the imagination. She appeared to ditch her underwear, teasing a look at her nude physique through the intricately cut mesh design that boasted a thigh-skimming handline. Newly single Sophie Casey, who recently split from her boyfriend of five years Joel Corey, made sure to show her expo exactly what he is missing as she slipped into a PVC red mini dress that sheathed her svelte figure. Sophie paired her daring bandeau frock with a pair of black Bailey Deer sandals and a faux fur scarlet red coat. Also putting on a stylish display was former Liberty X star Michelle Heaton, who oozed glamour in an all-black ensemble. The mother of two rocked skin-tight black leather leggings along with a matching halter neck top with cut-up detailing, as she flaunted a beautifully bronzed complexion. Stephanie Snowden had her ample cleavage on full display for the evening, rocking an animal print crop top and matte cut-up leather trousers to support her co-star in his third MMA fight. Aaron was once again triumphant in his big fight, beating Carl within 40 seconds of arriving in the cage, and the star put on a victorious display after his win. Speaking to the mirror after the fight, he said, I got a bit excited and came off the game plan for 10 seconds and got caught.
but then I settled down and caught him with a big right hand dot I saw him go down and I jumped all over him. You don't get paid over time in here. The 30 year old has also hinted that a rising career in MMA fighting could mean a departure from Geordie Shaw in the near future. Speaking at his last fight in September, Aaron told Mail Online, Geordie Shaw is my job, that's what has made us, but obviously I'm 30 now and I have a girlfriend, so maybe it's my time to step out of Geordie Shaw and let somebody younger come in. I've done what I need to do on there. Don't you have to understand the show doesn't grow old, but we do. Six years ago it was fun, but we're getting older. The audience is getting younger and we're getting older.